Planet Zoo has been rated E10 plus by the ESRB for crude humor, mild blood, and mild violence. It is generally suitable for people aged 10 years and up. From the turreted castle and Main Street to Monte Cristo Island and Kukwana Land, Bartholomew Zenon's Zenon Land is protected by the Night Sheriff. Day and night, he is burdened by a witch's curse to be aware of all that live and play within the massive fantasy theme park. Now an attack on the park by a monster hunter who knows far too much threatens everything, guests, staff, and fellow supernaturals taking refuge in the park. The night sheriff must scramble to uncover not only the source of the threat, but secrets of the park of which even he was not aware. If he doesn't, he may be doomed. The park may be doomed. Even the world may be doomed. And that's a lot of doom. Get your copy at Amazon.com today. Hey kids, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the Emerald Deep Zoological Park. As you can see before us, what we're doing today is giant anteaters. We're going to add a giant eater, giant anteater habitat uh, in this area here. And uh, it's going to just be one step closer to finishing the wetlands animals. Uh, the other wetlands animals that I need to do are, of course, the giant otters and the Malayan tapirs. I'm thinking about moving the giant otters down here maybe um and then making the cat area that i started with the cougars move in down this way don't mind this stuff that's just metal fences but anyway we shall see got a vip let's talk to the vips uh-huh get that free conservation credits now i have already started um I have already started planning the next zoo, the Sequoia, the, the Sequoia Park Zoo. Uh, it's going to be a Great Northwest themed zoo, you know, North American lumberjack com uh, country and all that number. Um, and it's going to involve more cold weather animals than, uh, than, than these. Basically the exact opposite of this zoo. I'm looking forward to working on it. Um, I've fixed some of the mistakes. I, I am or not really fixed, but I'm not going to be performing some of the mistakes that I made with this zoo with the Sequoia Park Zoo, if that makes any sense at all. I hope it does because it made sense in my head. So anyway, guys, uh, yeah, let's get started with the anteaters. I don't expect this is going to be all that, um, all that long a build because it's fairly straightforward. I have a general idea of what I want to do. Um, not an amazing idea, you know, but a general one. I, I tried to come up with something new and amazing for, for these guys, and I, it's, I just came up empty. So, you know, we're, we're going to do what we can and let Mother Nature do the rest. Ain't no doubt about it. That's a song lyric, guys. I'm not, I'm not going to continue. But, uh... It's by Meatloaf and the song's Paradise by the Dashboard Light, if you're curious. I want to see if I have something. I think I do. Never be afraid to use blueprints, guys. Um, other people put work into them. I've made lots of them, and they're all up on the... Uh, uh, they're all up on the website if you want to take a look at it and maybe use one of mine. Why would I not be able to afford that? You know what? I don't care. I don't care. It's okay. All right. Apparently I was looking for South American wall pieces, but it doesn't look like, yeah, maybe this. We'll use this. But, uh, you know, uh, um, what was I saying? Oh, anyway, uh, I, I know I have a blueprint that's basically three blank walls. You know, it's not um, uh, uh, buildings like this. It's literally blank walls. So, you know, we will see. Um, what I want to do here, 
I don't even know what that beepy noise was. Hold on just a second. Yeah, my head my my headphones are still functional. I guess uh, that's not what it was. It might be my phone telling me it's charged because I am charging my phone off my computer as I as I do this. Um, but you know, whatever it was, it doesn't matter. So yeah, I'm gonna turn this over to the uh, speed build. We're gonna get right into it, and uh, I will talk to you when we're done. Houston, we've had a problem. So I'm in the middle of the build, and everything's going fine. And without me noticing, the recording software just quits. It, it crashes. And I don't get any notification. I don't get any, you know... Any, any way to tell, there's no, you know, oh, hey, by the way, your recording software died on you. So you guys missed the last half of this build. Um, as you can see, like I said, coming in, it was a pretty simple build. I mean, it was a fast build, too. And oh, my God, we have babies. I did not know we were going to have baby anteaters. 
Yes, that's very cool. I always like how they walk around on their on their knuckles. So anyway, um, these are the anteaters, uh, the the giant anteaters. You know, we've got all the usual stuff, the the education signs. You know, we we've got trees and and plants and flowers and toys for them to play with, and they've got a bed inside the ruin. It's all very cool, and you missed it, and I want to apologize for that. Because I also talked about future plans. I talked about the upcoming Sequoia Park Zoo. I talked about... Um, uh, 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 I'm going to take care of some of these while I'm here. Uh, I talked about... Uh, Holy shit, look at that. You know what? No, cancel that. We're going to send him to the Trade Center and put him on trade because he's amazing. Um, you know, I, I talked about uh, what else I was planning on doing for this zoo and how much longer I thought that it would work. And, uh, 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 you know, it, it, all my expectations, the usual things when you, when you talk about stuff at the end of a, a video. And, um, you know, I talked about the animals and about the, the various DLC and the rumors that, um, that, uh, mod support was going to be coming in. Now, I don't play with mods right now, but, uh, you know, I know people who do. And, uh, uh, most of the mods for this game are new species and there's nothing wrong with that kind of thing because that's that's actually kind of cool um you know it's not like make it easier to do this or or earn money faster or you know they're not cheats they're just new animals and uh i could easily see myself playing with mods if mods got support from the makers of the game i'm not just going to jump up and mod the game without some way of ensuring that you know the mods aren't going to kill my computer but um, anyway, yeah, that's coming up, and they've announced that there's going to be... A, yeah, I think they said there's going to be another DLC in January or February, one of the two. Maybe it was March. I don't know. Um, anyway, you know, and I talked about all this. I, I talked about the uh, changes to my plans. I was going to uh, start curling the, the, the big cats this way while bringing the giant otters down into this space and the Malayan tapirs into this space so that the uh, big cats would act as kind of a curb for them and then after that moving on to deal with the reptiles that was my plan that was what I announced um, I was going to move Nile monitors into this space for example because I'm moving the, the Malayan tapirs down here anyway I said all that and you guys missed all of it and I'm very sorry for that because you know I thought it was a pretty good speech so anyway, guys, um, you know, again, sorry that this happened. Uh, you got to see what I had, uh, what, what, what I was able to salvage. Um, everything worked out. The next, um, the next habitat on the schedule is going to be the Bengal tigers, and I'm planning on putting them down here somewhere. And then after that will be the giant otters, and they're going in here. And uh, we'll do the Malayan Tapers, I think, after that. And uh, uh, I, I'll probably finish the big cats and then move on to the reptiles. That's the plan. So, like I said, if you liked what you saw here, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already, because I can always use new ones. Um, if you do subscribe, don't forget to hit that, that notification bell so you don't miss a single one of my videos. And... Uh, Drop a comment, please. I love hearing from you. Let me know what you want to see. Um, we've I've got a brand new zoo coming up that I'm already starting to uh, I'm already starting to plan for, and uh, should be pretty good. But uh, I mean, all my zoos are good. Let's face it. If I do say so myself, and I do. But I also oh I also have two new game series out. I don't know if you're interested in it. It's uh, it's playing the City of Heroes and City of Villains MMOs, which are 20 years old and, and technically dead, but are being run on private servers. So yeah, I've, I've just started doing that. We finished the Halo project. Um, 
I'm not that far from the end of Cyberpunk. And believe it or not, I've, I've had it suggested that I start a new playthrough. I don't think I want to do that since it's, you know, we're, we're, we're up over 300 episodes. But uh, that game is, is coming, is coming uh, close to being finished also. So, uh, yeah. That's all I got to say. I'll talk to you later, guys. Bye-bye.